That's going to St. Albans City. Class 700, the main north and south connection of London is here. Between 1997 and 2022, we have the wonderful operator of Thameslink. On March 1997, Thameslink was the first operator after Network Southeast with 66319s on the Midland and Brighton main line. Don't forget that little bit to Wimbledon and Sutton. Train mainly ran as a coach in, and the livery was cool. On April 2006, Perth Group took over the franchise with the network fully crammed. They took the A1319 through what was Southern South Central. That increased their number to 84319s. They ordered 23377 Electro Stars from Bombardia. They also introduced Seven Oaks to Kentish Town via Catford. Class 700, the main north and south connection of London is here. Between 1997 and 2022, we have the wonderful operator of Thameslink. When First Group ran the franchise, they called it First Capital Connect. They might have introduced 12 coach trains, but they still failed the franchise. September 2014, enough was enough. First Group was stripped from the franchise. Cancellation and delays, don't forget some strikes and a lot of overcrowding. Sheesh! So Govia is the current owner of the Templin franchise. Let's break down what they've done. They replaced all the trains with Class 700s, a fleet of 155, 55 12 coaches, and 60 with 8 running across the tracks. There was a slight delay with the 700s So they leased out some 387s Class 700s, the main north and south connection of London is here Between 1997 and 2022 We have the wonderful operator of Cambridge to Brighton and London King's Cross Peterborough to Horsham via Red Hill Bedford to Brighton and Gatwick Airport, Luton to Raynham via Greenwich, St Albans City to Sutton via Wimbledon Mitcham Junction, and London Blackfriars to Seven Mokes. I hope you did enjoy this story of Thameslink. See you all soon.